Hello and welcome once again to Bread of Life, a program to encourage you from God's Word. Our speaker for this week is Pastor Edward Haynes of Hartford. Well, praise His holy name. It's a great day to be alive. I tell you, it's a great day to operate and express a brand new identity, to be restored to the original identity of Jesus Christ. That's who you and I are. We are experiencing and expressing the identity of God in the earth. It is amazing. It is absolutely awesome. And I'm telling you right now, God has done an amazing work in you, an amazing work in me, an amazing work in us. I'm Pastor Eddie Haynes, Resurrection Life Christian Center Church International here in Hartford, Connecticut. We're talking about identity restoration. The character of Jesus Christ, the very character of the Father, the very character of the Holy Spirit, but specifically the character of Jesus Christ being now our expression in everything that we do in life, our expression as more than conquerors, our expression as those who have been called, anointed, and appointed by Almighty God. We are the identity of God in the earth. And I'm telling you right now, the miracles, the signs, the wonders, everything is following your life. Everything is following our lives because we are believers. We believe that we are more than conquerors. So we've looked at the scriptures and we saw some things that in the name of Jesus, we have now refused to look at our old identity. We refuse to look at the old way that we've done things. In the midst of all of the attacks that the enemy is throwing at us, we are responding back with the truth of God. We're responding back with the answers from God. Satan may make attempts. He may make attacks at your life. He's trying to bring you to ruin. It's impossible to bring you to ruin. It's impossible for you to end up in defeat when your identity has been restored and it is exactly manifesting the very character and the attributes of Jesus Christ. That's why Matthew, Mark, Luke, and John becomes the very foundation of our lives because we see how Jesus operated. We see how Jesus dealt with Satan, Satan's kids, how Jesus dealt with circumstances. And we are releasing our faith in the very promises of God and it is working. That's why we're praising more. We're praying more. We're walking in a new boldness. We're walking with a new wisdom. We're walking with a new confidence. Why? Because our identity has changed. You cannot try to label us what we used to be before Christ. We are in Christ right now, born again, and we are more than conquerors. Last time we dealt with this here, in the last broadcast, we was talking about this whole thing, conquerors, what it means to be a conqueror, a hooping the KO, literally to vanquish beyond. We looked at that word vanquish. It means to overcome in battle. Yes, you have some battles. I have battles. But we are overcomers in all battles. We subdue Satan and his attacks completely. We are literally defeating Satan in every conflict and every contest. And this is the one that I love about this whole vanquishing thing, this whole getting the mastery over Satan. We are mastering our emotions, our passions, and our temptations in the midst of conflict with the enemy. We literally have risen to a place that we're gaining decisive victory over and over and over and over. This word gain is an interesting word, to gain mastery. That's your identity. That's who you are. That's what God is expressing through you and teaching you how to get better at it. Gaining mastery. Literally, God has given us the resources and the advantages acquired through increase. You have begun to increase in your spiritual connectivity. You have begin to increase in your prayer time, your praise time, your study time. These are the things that keeps your connectivity robust and moving forward. Glory to God. Literally, you have acquired the power of God. This is what that word gain means. It means an increase in amount and magnitude. Your magnitude is increased. This is a change in your identity. You have gained efficiency. That's a change in your identity. This word gain means the increase caused by an amplifier. Almighty God, the Father, the Son, the Holy Spirit, they are the amplifier in your life. They are the gain, the boost in your life. When you face challenges from now on, you literally are facing challenges in the name of Jesus, armored up. 
You are equipped with the glory of God. You're manifesting the glory. We're getting to know this glory. Next time we get together, we're going to talk about the glory. I'm Pastor Eddie Haynes, Resurrection Life Christian Center Church International here in Hartford, Connecticut. We'll see you next time. You've been listening to Pastor Edward Haynes of Hartford, and this has been Bread of Life, a program to encourage you from God's Word.